it's Elliot here with a with a new creation. Um, it's the U.S. docking the docking. Uh, I mean, invading uh, the Japanese uh, the coast of of Japan. And um, I want this to be my only review video, but that's just not gonna happen. This big boat is here. It's packed with details and details and stuff. So. I, so I gotta do one video on this and one video on the on the land and the small boats. So I just I'm just gonna have to bring this out of the way here. And so we're gonna start with the biggest uh the biggest smaller ship. So this is the big ship, it's it's its little gold ship and it's uh and it just guards that. It's so for emergency soldiers can go down here and shoot through those little holes. The lifeboats right there. Um, and then there's some more holes. Uh, there's this piece covering up some holes inside. So for for more emergencies, soldiers can shoot out. I mean, not soldiers. Uh, crew members, because this one only has crew members, not navy guys. And then, but this is a, I'm going to kind of turn it around so you can kind of look in. This is the kitchen, and it, and, uh, and, uh, there's not much in there, just a guy and stuff. And they let the, uh, the officers, the really high officers and the captain have beards on the, on the ship. So, then here's the captain right there. I want a missile right here. Then you go up the stairs, and then there's a big machine gun. You can, it can't turn on anything, it just stays there. And then there's... A small little ship that has a big, big machine gun that can, you know, go different ways. Then there's two guys here, shooting off. Then there's kind of like a driver. The driver, he's not really the captain, he's just kind of the driver. Then Germany, Japan, Italy, uh, Great Britain, and and we, you know, the U.S., have these flags that say whatever the country starts with, and then D, what, that stands for defenses, so, like, German defenses or something, but this is American defenses, because, you know, it's this is American ship. And down here is just some rock right here is an officer that got shot. And, and then the Japanese, they let all their guys have uh, beards or whatever. Ha they let their soldiers have beards, but the U.S. doesn't. That, that's, that's just something that I made up. That's okay, I can fix that. And there was a, a two soldiers running right there. And then right here. Careful. Oh man, really? Not again. Uh, sorry, sorry guys, it's just that the glove container just spills out gloves. I, I, I wish it was had a, I wish I put on like a, like a cover for it, but I didn't, so, yeah. There's, there's the, there's that, um, where they get their, uh, uniforms on and then there's a telescope and a missile launch one they have to they have to crank this and then they can launch the missile then kind of like where they put their weapons then here is where they keep all their gloves then the guy right there one time i put this in and it was backwards you don't want to do that you have to look which way it's facing and there was um, some guys shooting, some guards. Uh, there's some guard booths that are just built in. And uh, here's one guy. Oops, oops, oops. Okay. There's one guy, uh, and he has a uh, a weapon, and it's shooting. Uh, so you know you can see those popcorn pieces, and. And why I do that is kind of old guns because the Japanese use uh, old style things. The Infinity War, we we use kind of 
of the, we we did use the the, the new guns, but kind of old World War Two stuff. Then the Germans and Italy they used um, they used the uh, robots and stuff, but we beat them. And then the Japanese were like, "Hey, respect history. It's good." And they're like, "No, we respect future." And they're like, they just kind of got in big fights about that. And there's another guy here. Now let's move up. Uh, there's an officer with a little light. Then a big machine gun that the guy's pushing. A, um, a Navy guy. This is my favorite guy. Of, what, what, one of my favorite mini figures I've probably ever made. He's a royal Japanese guard. He's for the emperor. And he has his big long uh, stick. I mean uh, sword. And a special helmet. And what this is. I'm a, if you didn't know, I'm a big fan of Aladdin, and I'm, and I'm going to make Jasmine's Palace uh, after this. So there's a little carpet tassel from the carpet, from the magic carpet. And then there's a bowl. And I clip that on the bottom and use it for the helmet. There's, then right here's um, a little missile kind of one, so another one. Then there's, oh, you, you know those kind of like, kind of like machine wheels that they use for Star Wars stuff. Like like the big um, walker, I can't remember the name, but, and it had uh, a circle, and then I just stuck two missiles in it. And uh, 